In this video, we're going to take a look at the WD Black SN770 NVMe SSD. This uses the PCIe G4 interface, and this is a great option for PC and Mac. You can use this as an external drive, or you could also use it as a boot drive on computers with a compatible motherboard. On the box, it promises speeds up to 5,150 megabytes a second on the read and 4,850 on the write. I have a USB 4 enclosure I've been testing this with, and I've been getting speeds of about 3,000 megabytes a second on the write side and 2,800 megabytes a second on the read side. So just know that you're going to be limited to the speed of whatever the device that you're using this is, whether it's the motherboard or the external enclosure you use this with. Now, whenever you first go to use this, you won't want to make sure that you format this drive, initialize it on your computer so it's going to be ready for use. What's great about M2 SSDs is they're super easy to install. Here we've got this external SSD and all you have to do is insert it at an angle, press it in, and then you just use the little pin to hold it down once you have it installed. And then you can put the cover on the SSD enclosure and you're ready to use this as an external SSD. This drive comes in capacities of either 250 or 500 gigabytes, or you can get it in one terabyte or two terabyte configurations as well. The price is gonna vary depending on which one you get. The one terabyte version of this retails for $100 and WD gives you a warranty of five years with it. So they're gonna have your back if you have any issues with this drive. And they say you can expect to get 600 terabytes written on this drive as well. So overall, I highly recommend this for anyone who's looking for a great drive to use either in an external enclosure, put it in a compatible dock, or you can also use it as a boot drive on select computers as well. If you're interested in buying one, I do have links in the description below. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions, I'll do my best to answer them. Like this video and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any upcoming content.